What's up, Pathways Church? I'm Nathan Purifoy. Welcome to today's Daily Dose. This week, we're gonna talk about something really interesting to me. We're gonna talk about my dad. My dad was always called Pastor P. As long as I can remember when he was a pastor, he was Pastor P. And uh, he has all these incredible stories and these incredible lessons that he would teach us as kids growing up. And my dad always had speech number one. Me and both of my brothers can recite this speech almost verbatim. When you grow up, I want you to be a man of honor and character and integrity. And he keeps going from there, explaining what those three characteristics mean. And this week, we're going to talk about some lessons that my dad taught. And we're going to start with that one, speech number one. And today we're talking about honor and why it's so important for me to tell these stories about my dad and to share them with you guys, because I had incredible parents. My mom and dad were always a unit. My dad was the teacher, the talker. My mom was a doer. And both of them were incredible parents. They were loving parents. They were very patient parents with three rambunctious young boys. And this lesson, honor, goes back to what it says in Exodus, whenever we see we read the Ten Commandments, Exodus chapter 20. Exodus chapter 20, verse 12, it says, honor your father and your mother so that you may live long in the land the Lord your God is giving you. It's the fifth commandment of the ten that were written down. And I want to honor my parents, but what exactly does honor mean? What does it mean to be a man or a woman of honor? Now, I think that we talk about honor often. We say how much we honor people on a regular basis, but honor requires action. We have to do something. We can't just talk about it. So I want my life to reflect the incredible parents that I had. I want my life to reflect the incredible leaders I've had in my past, the pastors that I've served under and served alongside, the friends that I have in my life that have made a huge impact on the man that I've become. I want to honor them by being a great person and setting a great example and showing that whoever this guy was around before, whoever this guy came from, they must have been good people. I want that to just be in people's mind naturally just because of who I am and my demeanor and my actions. I want to honor those people. I also want to obey my parents when they ask me to do something. I want to be respectful of their opinions. I want to share my life with them. I want to invite my mom to come spend weeks with us in Wisconsin. I want to ask her questions about what she's going through and find out about her week. And I want to honor her in our relationship together. And I want my wife and my mother to be close, just like I want to be close to Jessica's parents. And all this is how I honor my mother, how I honor my father. Honor is so much more than just something we talk about. It's something that we do. It's a respect that we have for the people that are around us and the people that have influenced us. And just like it says here for our parents, I know there can be a lot of tension in a parent and son or parent and daughter relationship, but we can still find ways to honor them and to love them and respect them and to set a good example for the people around us so that they can assume, so that they can believe, so that they can see that we've had good parents, that we've had good friends when we honor them and good leaders and bosses when we honor them. So thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. I'll see you tomorrow on The Daily Dose.